40% of Italy's tomatoes are produced in Puglia. And they're also the inventors of burrata cheese, a heavenly fresh mozzarella filled with cream and curds. And it's these two specialties of Puglia that are the stars of my risotto al pomodoro, e burrata, tomato and burrata risotto. These tomatoes I've crushed by hand just to release all the juices, and I'm adding them to a pot of vegetable broth. Now I just want that to heat through, and that's gonna be the flavorful liquid for my risotto. Whilst that's heating up, This is a boreal rice, a short grain rice that is packed full of starch. And it is that starch that we want to pull out because it makes the risotto creamy and delicious. But first, I need to give it a good toasting. Make sure each grain is coated with just a little oil and it helps bring out the wonderful flavors of that rice. Next, a good splash of dry white wine. Now I can add my first couple of ladles of tomatoey vegetable broth. Turn the heat down a touch to a gentle simmer. And the art of making risotto is gentle, constant stirring and watching that rice absorb all that moisture. My risotto is cooked the way I'd like it. The finishing touches I'm gonna do right here. Grated pecorino, sheep's milk cheese that has a lovely little tang to it with a salty little hit. It's gonna to add to the creaminess and the richness. Fresh, fragrant basil, just torn, just enough to release those wonderful aromas. And I love a risotto that has a little runniness to it. I don't want to see it sitting stiffly in the plate. And now for the burrata. Look at this, see how soft and supple that is? I like to break a little piece off and add a little to the risotto before I serve. And the word burrata actually means buttery because of how creamy and buttery the burrata actually is in the middle. It is such a prized cheese. Some beautiful pomodorini, little cherry tomatoes. More fresh basil. And olive oil. A real tribute to Puglia is this dish. After a little work, a little patience, I get to taste. And how creamy does that cheese look? Very tempting. This is comfort food at its finest. 